I owe you my thanks. You have helped the Dragonflights remember our calling. With the Oath Stones renewed, we can finally reclaim our Aspectral power. This has to work. Nothing? But the Oath Stones were renewed. How is this possible? <laughs> What have you done? You proved yourself unworthy. All on your own, Queen of the Dragons. Now, it is our time. done. We stopped her. No. The damage is too great. They're about to... Sister. What have they done to you? Her death. Demands vengeance. All who betrayed dragon kind to the titans will face our world. Kadgar, we cannot win this fight. We have to get out of here. My friends. We sensed a great upheaval beneath the earth, and feared the worst. We barely survived. Razageth is dead, but... Her kin have been freed. Oh. Nazdormu? What is it? The time ways. They are... Chaotic, but still obscured. A dark future looms on the horizon. We haven't long to prepare for their onslaught. Razageth's reckless haste cost her life, and they will not make that mistake again. They will regain their strength and choose their next moment carefully. Then we must take the fight to them. Strike before they are recovered. That will be difficult. Eridicron's mastery of the Earth will harbor them and keep them out of our reach. What is it about this Eridicron that vexes you so? Of the three that remain, Viranoth and Farag were ever loyal to the Incarnate's ideals. But it was Eridicron who truly embraced the war. The last captured, and the most difficult to contain. At the end, he struck terrible bargains to keep their cause alive. His violent desperation makes him dangerous. I believe the other incarnates never knew the true depths of his depravity. We must not despair. Their war is coming. And while we may not yet have our spectral powers, we can rebuild our unity. Heal the wounded flights. Embrace our allies. Only together 
Do we stand any chance of victory? Together. Together. 